The Arthur Sotts Department of Music offers so many different experiences and opportunities for students, and that can include majoring in music, minoring in music, taking academic classes, participating in one of our 14 different ensembles. It could involve taking lessons at Eastman, practicing on the University Carillon, or just using one of our practice rooms. Most of our courses are geared towards the non-music major who nonetheless loves music and wants to continue doing what they did in high school or to explore new things about music. Very few people know that there's really anything else going on in music except Eastman, but it's a professional school, students who are going to be musicians for a living, which leaves out all of the other kinds of students who, who want to study music as part of some other kind of a degree or study music as a major in the context of a scholarly uh, endeavor. Arthur Satz was a student here in the college in the 1950s, and at that time there was no music major available to college students, so Arthur was an entrepreneur. He took advantage of all of the opportunities here and put together his own curriculum, and that became, in a sense, the model for what we built 30 years later. I'm a double major in music and public health. A big reason why I chose to come to the university was just the flexibility that's offered. I think that we have such a wide array of classes and there's truly something for everybody. So I'm actually not a music major at all. I'm a biology major. I had to always do something musically related with my classes. My major is very heavy in terms of course loads and credits. So being able to step back and be part of a choir, it's been very inviting to someone like me who's already had like a really heavy major to be like, hey, yeah, you can do this too, even if you're busy. Our students, they're so busy and they're so driven in their other areas that oftentimes the only chance they have to pick up the instrument is when they come to rehearsal. So our ensemble directors do a fantastic job at choosing repertoire that is going to be inspiring to them, that's terrific music, that is challenging, but it's not overwhelming. It, it's not so hard that they're going to get discouraged and want to drop out. Arthur thought that music was essential to being an educated person, and he thought that it nurtured the human spirit in ways that nothing else could. There's just something about the way the arts work that shapes the way we are as human beings that's incredibly, incredibly valuable. Something that's really important is to remember in terms of being a biologist or a scientist, the humanity cannot be excluded. And I think that being part of the humanities as well as the sciences kind of bridges those worlds together. It's truly just been a dream come true. I feel like ever since I first started playing the cello, I like wanted to be an orchestra teacher. I like wanted to have the same impact that my teachers had had on me on students of my own one day. We're living at a time where humanities departments across the country often aren't feeling fully supported. And what this gift will ensure is that for decades to come, we will be able to continue to pursue our core mission, which is to provide our undergraduates with the best possible experience that we can.